we never stopped doing the complete pandemic. Uh, back in April, uh, when these cruise ships were coming back in, and they had people that were, you know, extremely sick, some were deceased, and the pandemic was new to all of us. We didn't know what to expect, but it was the men and women of Local 1416 that put their lives and their safety at risk to make sure that those ships were serviced. After they got turned away at other ports, our men and women got in hazmat suits, you know, risked their safety and health and that of their families to service those vessels and make sure that, you know, what needed to be done was done. In addition to that, we never worked, stopped working a day of cargo at all to keep commerce going in this country, in this community. Uh, you know, the medical supplies that were needed, the food that was needed, everything that was needed to keep our society going, a longshoreman or woman has something to say or do about it, 24-7, 365. So in my mind, I don't know what could be more essential than that, than making sure our fellow American citizens um, had what they needed to continue to live their lives in the best way that they knew how through this unknown pandemic that we all were, were virtually blindsided for and didn't have any answers for. So everything was um, done, you know, on the spot. You had to think fast, you had to move fast, but you had to be committed. And that's what ILA 1416 was during the pandemic.